The new Hadassah Intervention Neurology Room has some of the world's most advanced equipment for neurological treatment, and it's the first one in Israel. Here we perform all our endovascular procedures. We are using this technology in order to see the arteries of the brain. I only see the arteries of his brain through the monitors. It looks like science fiction, but it's, I mean, instead of opening the skull to treat a cerebral disease, we try to reach the brain through the normal arteries of the body. By this means, I can take care of or I can treat cerebral aneurysms or, try, or, or I can reopen arteries that were previously occluded, treating this common disease that is called stroke. An immigrant from Argentina, Dr. Jose Cohen made Aliyah to Israel. He is passionate about saving lives and about Israel. My main drive to come here was uh, the most pure Zionism. I didn't think about economical reasons. I mean, this is not a place to think of uh, economical profits. But uh, definitely I feel quite better working here than in any other place. I mean, I'm here in the middle of my people, trying my I mean, trying to save my people, trying to help my people. So I'm not searching for any other reward. David Ben Gigi, 23 years old from Jerusalem, born at Hadassah Hospital, married his childhood sweetheart, Aki Noam. David was a member of the elite Duvdevan Special Forces. In February 2004, Aki Noam was seven months pregnant with their first child. David was called with his unit to go on a special mission to capture the lead terrorist in the bus number 19 fatal bombing when he was critically wounded in a firefight. He was hit by, by a bullet that entered through his mouth and injured one of the big vessels of the neck. He was profusely bleeding through his mouth. I, I never saw something like this. We understood that a major vessel uh, nourishing the brain was completely uh, sectioned in two pieces and then we performed the treatment of this condition I mean I did I didn't study th this type of treatment it's not uh, described in the literature because most of the patients with th this type of condition they die in the way to the hospital the emergency workers raced against the clock to get David to Hadassah in Karam the fact that he arrived at the hospital within minutes of being injured had a huge impact on the efforts of saving his life as soon as I was hit, I was overcome by a strong feeling that I was going to die. I was scared of dying. This was the true meaning of fear of death. In a matter of seconds, images of my wife, my unborn child, my mourning parents, and the eulogy at my funeral flashed before my eyes. We got into the intensive care unit, and David was there lying. Um, with all sorts of machines. When he woke up, he looked at me and put his hand on my belly. We then realized that he was going to be okay. When I woke up, I met Jose Cohen for the first time. I said to him, Toda. I had nothing else to say except, thank you for saving my life. He looked at me and said, are you thanking me? I should be the one to thank you and all the soldiers. You are the true heroes. With his devotion and motivation, he gave me back what I was about to lose, my life. The birth was the most amazing experience in my life. A new life was put into my hands. Well, for me, Hadassah is a place that I got there my son back. And uh, I got my granddaughter there. Hadassah is a building. Hadassah is people. But for me, it is a love affair. Achinoam and I were in hospital for three weeks. Hadassah was our house. They treated us so warmly, so with a lot of care, with a lot of warmth. There isn't anything I can think about it that we asked and they didn't get for us. 
we got some so much love. The fact that the vid was in Odessa uh, meant a lot to me, to us. We knew that he is in the best hand he could be. I want to say thank you. What Jose is doing at Adasa is a sacred work. We live in a complex reality. We are being physically attacked and hurt. But if the power of medicine can save the soldiers who risk their lives to protect the country and its people, then each one of the people who sit here today is a partner to Hadassah's work of saving lives. <laughs>